our colours in objects. If we look at a, in take a modern object, you know, a pillar box, uh, and the experience of the red of the pillar box, we now call qualia, sensation. What is that relationship? Is the red really in the pillar box? And that was a question that Locke and Newton were, were both concerned with, both wrote about, and they both came to the view that the colour is not in the object, it's in the eye, it's in the brain, but not in the object out there. And as soon as you said that, of course, it means that perception cannot be direct. But all that started, as far as I can understand it, from Locke and Newton, who, who argued about this, you know, and set up a debate that still continues. Because the question now is what is actually out there? Is heaviness out there? Is squareness out there? Is a straight line actually straight out there or not? It, what, or is colour on its own? Is it something different? Locke talked about primary and secondary characteristics, and this is still a very, very difficult issue. What is primary actually out there? What is secondary created by the brain? And it's still a matter, I think, of debate.